go ahead and beep it for me, please? Very cool. Thank you. All right, so my name's Michael. Um, I was asked to tell you guys about this bike here. We've got a 1947 Columbia. Um, right here, check the badge out on that. Got the horn with it, original headlight. I put a little eyeball on there just to, uh, you know, spice it up a little bit. It's missing the lens. It's all original paint. This actually does have the original tires on it from 1947. Um, the gentleman I bought it off of had some John Deere tire implement. You know, I guess it preserved the rubber on the tires, but original seat, um, the mud flap actually on it. I just bought this at the last car show that I went to. Um, I couldn't believe it because it matches the bike perfectly, honestly, in my opinion. Paint and everything. Um, it is a skip tooth sprocket. So if you look right here, usually you have a, a, um, a sprocket tooth in every one of these grooves right here. This is so spread out like that. That's how they did it back in the day because if you look at the chain too, it's only got grooves every, you know, so far. But they, uh, I don't know why they did it back in the day, just to, uh, I think it was to increase movement speed possibly, because the smaller the teeth are, you know, you get the more you gotta pedal and stuff like that. And these are heavy bikes, so they're built to last. <laughs> that's, uh, that's all I gotta say about it.
Thank you.